So listen, I got <laughs> I got you, Popolizio, Garnett, and the mop. You guys got the mop in the background. I don't know what that is. I don't know what we're doing here, but I'm in a good group though. You, tell me about yeah. Washington and Lee. What's going on? What are the sheer what what's the, the Clyde, Ohio, the pride of Clyde, Ohio doing in Virginia? To build a championship program, what are the Shearers doing? Yeah, moved down to Lexington, Virginia about seven years ago. Uh, right now we're in the middle of a uh, athletics re uh, renovation project, so about two years. We're going to get a new athletic facility, include a wrestling room and all that stuff. So, uh, yeah, had the opportunity to come down to Washington and Lee. And, uh, it's one of the top schools in the country and in uh, beautiful Shenandoah Valley, surrounded by the Blue Ridge Mountains. So I'm a country boy. You know, anyway, it's just a little bit more hilly and no hills mountains. where you're from. <laughs> no hills. There's there's a lot of dryers and washers where you're from. The the world headquarters of, of Whirlpool, right? Whirlpool, University of Whirlpool. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's really what they call the Clyde yeah. graduates, right? Hey, uh, Washington Lee's. Cornfields. Uh, yes, Washington Lee's a little different than Clyde State University <laughs> and and the Whirlpool. You know, where you come from is a blue collar, gritty town, right? Yeah. Industry. Right, most everybody, probably every other family, someone works at the Whirlpool. How much different is your life now, you know, as an educator, a teacher, and, and, and the path that you've taken, how much different is it? I'd say it's kind of close to 180. I mean, just uh, being involved in an institution like this with all the resources and um, being a recruit, you know, really across the world, because students are coming from all over the country. Um, it's really opened my eyes and been a huge educational experience for me to experience that and, you know, be a, you know, I'm associate professor at the university, and it's kind of it's just what an awesome are you thing associate being professor? Of? I gotta know this right now. <laughs> I'm associate professor of physical education. Are you? And then you know you you're on a lot of you're on a committee. You're on the NCA committee. Yeah, I, I currently chair the NCA committee. And now I rotate off September first. That was a four year appointment. Um, I'm on the executive board for the uh, uh, NWCA, and been you know, I'm involved on the campus too. So yeah, just. A lot of good things going on. The Shears are making it happen down in the Shenandoah Valley. Yeah, it's beautiful. You know, what are you looking for? We're, you know, we're at the Combine here with Compound, and what are you looking for in a recruit? We obviously know they have to have elite Ivy League type transcripts and grades and test scores, right? Mm -hmm. What are you looking for beyond a really good student? What are you looking for in here when you watch a practice? No, just, I mean, a lot of the typical things, uh, obviously we mentioned the academic profile, but outside of that, the, what kind of uh, experience the kid may be looking for at the next level. You know, some people want a, a big urban setting, we're a rural school, um, a lot of opportunities in the off season, you know, to, to study abroad and, and uh, internships and research, so it's just kind of, it's tailored to the individual and the experience that literally looking to get out of college, and, uh, you know, it can take many shapes and forms, so, yeah. We're yeah. about to get rolling here, you got anything else for me? No. Go Ohio, go, go Zeb, and thanks. Hey man, thanks for the time, good luck to you guys moving forward, and I can't wait to see this new facility. Yeah, thank you.